Four out of ten, let's go! Yeah! No, I don't want to kiss. No. Yeah, four out of four. I don't want it. Get away from me. Bro, I'm scared. Please. Help me, bro. She's four in the streets. She's a four. <laughs> Damn, bro. That's... Well, it's crazy out here, so hey guys, welcome back to another video, y'all. So we got another reaction video for you guys today, y'all. So today we're going to be reacting to women getting rejected by men. So I hope you guys enjoy this type of video. If you guys do, let me know in the comment section so I'll upload more. Um, yeah, without further ado, let's just get into the video, y'all. Don't shoot. Hands up, don't shoot. What up, sweetheart? No, yeah. no, no, no so more. Good. Your eyes are... Beautiful. Look I'm not with this TikTok shit. <laughs> He's not with that TikTok shit. Yeah. Damn. I'm not over there. Yeah. L. 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 You're a four out of ten. Let's no. go. Yeah. No, 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 I don't want to kiss. No. Yeah, four, nine, four. <laughs> I don't want it. Either. Get away from me. Bro, I'm scared. Please. Help me, bro. She's four in the streets. She's a four. <laughs> Damn, bro. That's that's mad disrespect, man. Bro is like, she's for the street and she's four out of ten. I, as you can tell, she's like really pissed, man. <laughs> Yo, she, she's serious man she's chasing him and shit bro that's crazy yeah this man just dodged a bullet and a potential disease because before this she was trying to kiss every man that she saw <laughs> for the night for the night so who you see that trying to kiss everyone bro imagine you pushing yourself into that situation man like she just be to make out with her Sweet cows, real quick. We're going. She belongs to the streets and to her fans and only fans that she sells herself to for less. That's big mad respect for that guy walking away, man, bro. Like these only fan girls, man. I just only fans girls. I I don't think they get it. Like there's nothing special about having only fan. Yeah, you're making money for yourself, but like, bro, I'm sure not a lot of guys want to see their girl on selling their things on social media for like 10.99 or 9.99 per month so it's in the price of a large pizza you got a hundred dollars cash or a bitcoin hundred dollars hundred dollars you didn't have to cut me off should a guy make yearly four hundred thousand this is ridiculous man four hundred thousand i mean that's not bad by slight bro a lot of the time, these women women ask for guys that make a lot of money. It's like, what are you gonna, you know, do for the guy, for that guy that make that much money to be, you know, be able to go for you? What are you gonna do for that person? You know, it's not only like, oh, I'm here, I'm a girl. You know, only me is enough. Some of y'all want a guys that like that that y'all don't even know how to wash dishes properly, man. Well, why you said it? I mean, there's bills, there's a car, there's a house, there's finances, there's out to eat, dinner, groceries, kids. So would you date somebody at, at, at his lowest? Why would I be broken happy? I don't know, man. I... Damn, that's that's crazy, though. Can't be broken happy. Can you be broken happy? Can you eat a sandwich and f somebody and get special? We need there's to no move problem. on. I mean, there's no problem with that, but it's like, bro, you don't want anybody broke. <laughs> I mean, that kind of... You know, it makes sense, but like, why do you think people that like maybe make 500k a year will also go for you? That ain't no problem. I can't. Well, why not? I can't get horny and be broke. Who the fuck do you think you are? Would you like support him? I mean, support him at what? Being broke? <laughs> I don't know. I will only support somebody at their best. I will only want you to be your best. This my. Wait, what? At, at their best? That's crazy, bro. Up it better become a nun or a cat tamer because there's no rich man that's gonna wanna. Women, listen to me. They don't fucking do that. <laughs> Is this your first time talking to women? Goddamn. <laughs> well, I, I oh, yeah. oh, nice. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> She's throwing that ass. All right, good. Oh. Yeah, they need to change that caption from free open to wall to free useless to wall. Absolutely useless. Are you a male or female? I'm an email. I'm an email. <laughs> <laughs> email. No. You're not a male. You're not a female. You are email. Uh, email. Email. Pop the balloon to reject the girl. My name is Dr. Elam. I'm 38 years old. And I pop my balloon just because you're simply too young. I mean, if you change your mind, I'm open. 
open to it though. Why would you be open to it? What? Because you're handsome for sure. one. So you only like and me because I'm beautiful. Just like I'm beautiful. Yeah, but that's not why I would only like you. So why would you like me? Because you didn't answer that. Because you can bring something and add something to my mm -hmm. life. But because you're a liability. But I feel like a lot of the girls saying, you know, all they need to just look cute and stuff like that. But like a lot of guys that actually make sense really don't go for their beauty that much, bro. It's what you're going to do, you know, for that person. Like the type of person you are, bro. You right. can't add anything to my life. Right. I don't disagree, but what are you expecting, bruv? You're on a YouTube channel where you've got to pop the balloon to reject her. What, what are you going to do? Find your wife on there? Thank you. Is that his real ear, bro? Oh, excuse me. My boyfriend dumped me yesterday and he was like, I don't know, I just didn't know I wasn't going to be ready for a relationship. And I totally get that. I mean, it was honestly unfair of me to expect him to be in touch with his own emotions because like boys get surprised by their own emotions. Like a baby gets surprised by a fart. I beg your pardon. They're like, ah, what's happening? They cry. They just don't get, they don't know. What the fuck are you talking about? Cry, that's crazy. But I mean, maybe, you know, he, he doesn't think you're the right person for him. I don't know. That he could be also the... The fact she's going to TikTok to tell this story to millions of random people just tells me everything I need to know about her mental state and why her boyfriend probably left her. I'm losing her. Have we tried everything? Is she married? Uh, yes. Ma'am, your husband has just sat down and he looks comfortable. <laughs> Babe, could you help me move? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Terry, so walk us through the nails too, man. The holiday. You know what I'm saying? So we just went to the uh, Yo, why is bro guys in nail done? The oh. person who's doing my nails said they could do a design, so they actually told me, um, they showed me a Christmas tree with some ornaments, so I decided to get some ornaments on it for Christmas. Nice. You know, a lot of people don't like that, but, uh, man, just kind of... <laughs> There's enough people encouraging this type of shit. I'm here to encourage you to stay masculine and to not paint your fucking nails. When you're talking about at the end, the men just want to be seen, blah, 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 yeah, and be yeah. like all heartfelt. Yeah. That is actually the women. Yeah. Because you guys have the power, so we just want to be seen. But you are seen in relationship terms and stuff. You're like adored instantly. Mm. That's the whole point where it's like women and pets from the minute they come out. Pets. <laughs> they are though. Like the minute a pet comes, a dog comes out, it's immediately loved. Yeah, because it's so cute. Men aren't immediately loved. And why is that open? No, but it's true. You've got to earn your worth as a man. You do have to earn your worth as a man. I don't think so. Listen, you do not know shit about fuck. You don't think so? No. Really? No. Are you sure? Yeah. Fair dude. There's some very cute people who would be immediately loved. <laughs> and some men with only a face a mother could love. It's just the way the world works. No, I'm not talking about like the simplest term of like, oh, look, he's cute. In a broader term of life, you have to earn your worth as a man. That is true. <sighs> you do have to do that. Because otherwise you get pushed to the wayside. You go around now, you go outside on the streets of London and, and go to a woman and say, your, your man, your potential future husband, how much do you want him to earn? How much do you want him to, what kind of lifestyle do you want for yeah, him? Yeah, but men are like but, that with women yeah, but, now. No but, if you're, no, but for the, the history of time, especially, it's worse now. You see it on TikTok where they're like, what do you want your man to earn a month? They're like, 10 grand. Oh, I see engagement which, ring which, ones. How yeah, much a man got to spend is, on a ring? Which is, again, yeah. such an alien mindset. So why? Bro, I feel like in my opinion, bro, like, you know, if you women think you should spend like 500k this much money on the ring or they don't want it, bro, I just feel like they're not the right person for you, bro. They're only kind of looking for the, you know, fancy stuff. Because I feel like, you know, getting a ring, it really doesn't matter what kind of price it is. It's kind of like where also it came from, you know what I'm saying? But like some people out here like thinking that men should spend 500k in a ring, bro, like that. That's just insane, bro. Point here is men. If you don't live up to this one percent standard, you just get pushed to the wayside. Mm. You could, you could leave me here now, and within an hour, have a geezer. Yeah. You are. I would have to graft someone for 
Give weeks. A young pretty woman can get on a yacht anywhere she wants just because she's pretty. A man, if he wants to get any important rooms, he's got to bring some sort of value. Rich men marry pretty broke women all the time. You don't see too many rich women marrying broke men just because they're good looking. Most men, whether they're fat, tall, handsome, short, whatever, have to earn their value. Let's be, let's be realistic, Samuel. It's about value. Uh, about yeah, value and your value before. is low. Oh, wow. Damn. And Damn. how do you know that? You're not Because you're five that? foot four and two Okay. And 37 years old with two kids. That's how I know. My in Kentucky. Not hold, he's not holding back, man. Okay. You, that's your opinion. It's not my opinion. You never seen my body before, so you just. I don't have like, to see your body. I know you're five foot four and almost with two kids in Kentucky. And I see your picture. You just say you And I'm listening to how you talk. And I'm listening to your energy. I'm listening to your tone. I'm listening to your relationships. See what it is, you ladies don't like when somebody is just direct with you, honest. I got no dog in this fight. I had a woman on here earlier and I told her she was absolutely gorgeous. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't know about this one to be honest. I'm pretty sure if men found out about an overweight 37 year old single mother, they'd all be racing to get to her. Half of all women have a guy on the back burner just in case things go wrong in their current relationship. And I have to sit here and defend all of us women. I was just as shocked reading this data. More than half of women who are married and categorize themselves as happily Wait a married. Sec. They're married. Happily married happily women are doing this? Have a backup plan. <laughs> God. I feel like I'm gonna just say this. <laughs> That's why I don't get married. Even if you do, don't sign no papers, man. Whatever they came with, they go with that, bro. So you don't lose. I feel like the end of the day, man. Like I just feel like you know, relationship here really don't last that long, man. Like today they love you. You never know. You wake up tomorrow and they're like, ah, I'm not feeling you no more. You know, so they go find another guy. So I'll probably never get married. I will get married, of course, but I'll. No government will be involved in something. And in most cases, it was either an ex-boyfriend or an old friend who never made it to the dating category. Get out of town. Unfortunately, yes. Problem is, is social media has just made it too easy to have such a type of behavior. See, this is why if you're a nice guy, you don't save these women from the streets. If that's where they belong, that's where you leave them. Or it'll bite you in the ass in the future when they get bored and they run back to the guy they actually want. But you, especially as a guy that I just almost do everything for a woman, bro. I feel like a lot of the women here, man, you know what I'm saying? You can do so much for them, but they really would not really care about none of that shit. They'll go and cheat on you and shit like that for guys that really don't do nothing to them, bro, for them. So it's like, bro, you really got to watch out out there, man. The Forex lifestyle is easy. Let's be honest. Yeah, the Forex lifestyle is so easy. Stop the cap. What do you do? Actually, I'm a trader. trader or a scammer like the rest of these muppets faking a lifestyle so they can steal people's money because most of these donuts are not making money from the thing they're telling you to do they're making money from the shitty course they're selling you which is basically free information from google they'll make these corny little tiktok edits flashing money and women because they know that's what attracts young men and young men are the most vulnerable and the ones that buy their shitty course don't fall for that type of shit because most rich people don't flash their money like that or make corny tiktok edits i went through a phase doesn't mean i'm not anymore sure does what was your affairs? I guess I'm kind of always going through them sometimes. So <laughs> <laughs> but, but I There's only one place you'll ever belong. She belongs to the street. I ain't gonna lie. That was a good one. And if you guys enjoyed this one, like, comment, and subscribe for more. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.